here. Uh, today I'm going to do a tutorial on the figure eight. First thing we're going to learn is how to do your figure eight, and then I'm going to teach you how to spice it up a little bit. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your arm, you're going to point it out, you're going to make an eight motion with your dominant arm. So I'm right handed, so I'm going to make an eight motion with my right arm. It's good if you use your wrist in this, guys, because a good figure eight uses your arm, your wrist, and your fingers. So if you practice right off the bat by using a using your wrist to do an eight motion, it's gonna help a lot later. So you're gonna do an eight motion. Doesn't matter how big it is, doesn't matter how small it is. But you're gonna do that once you get decent to where you can do the figure eight from the start or how good you've gotten with it. You can take your undominant hand, either lead or follow by your dominant hand, like this. Once you get that, whoops, messed up. Once you get it, you're gonna it's gonna look out pretty much figure eight. You're gonna be able to go faster and faster, and it's gonna end up looking good, like a figure eight. It's gonna have good form. A little tips on that is. To add bulkiness to the figure eight motion, guys, on the bottom, so it makes your eight kind of spread apart. Cause that's important, guys. If your eight's not spread apart, it's not gonna look good. So now you've gotten down your figure eight. What you're gonna do is you're gonna add motions with your fingers. That sounds weird, but let me show you. The beginning, say the beginning of the figure eight. It's the beginning of the song. You start it off, your figure eight's small. Use one finger, figure eight looks skinny, not very good, you know. Doesn't look very impressive. It looks kind of like a bland figure eight. Or another way is to put your fingers together, like kind of making a mouth with your fingers, a mouth, and then you do it like that. And as you're doing it, you're either gonna add more fingers and spread out your hands so it looks like a bulky figure eight and that's going to add a lot of uh, kind of base to your figure eight it's going to make your figure eight pop out and you can do that really well when you're uh, in the song like the song's bass drops or something like that that's always good or when the song speeds up um, another thing on the figure eight is a figure eight doesn't necessarily have to be up and down. You can do it to where it's like side to side. I mean, figure eight's pretty various. Uh, other than that, there's not much else I can teach you guys. Practice, um, subscribe, like, anything you guys need. Just right on the bottom, and uh, I'll get to it as soon as I can. This is Mickey. Peace.